Welcome to the flowerschool.com video library. I'm Leanne Kessler, director of the Floral Design Institute, and today I want to share with you the easiest gardenia corsage ever. Of course, starting with an absolutely perfect gardenia, removing the back leaves so you have just the beautiful bloom. The base will be a ribbon with an extra set of tails so that it's ready to tie on as a wrist corsage. A little bit of ruscus foliage, and then the magic is in the details. Spray down your gardenia really well with crowning glory. That will coat the surface, making it last longer, and then protecting it from browning. For adhering it to the ribbon, a combination of Oasis Floral Adhesive and 3M Super 77 Spray Glue. I start with the foliage, just adding a small amount of the Oasis Floral Adhesive to the base. Let it start to dry. Then, just inserting it between the loops of the ribbon, tucking it in tightly, adds a nice framework. And then let it dry. To add the gardenia, spray the back with the Super 77 spray glue. Just getting the back petals, I've already done that so that I didn't have to do it in the studio. Then cutting the stem down, very, very short, just enough to hang on to. Then a dab of the Oasis Floral Adhesive, and a dab of the Oasis Floral Adhesive. Let it begin to dry. Then very, very carefully, so that you don't bruise the petals, just take and nestle it right down in, letting the petals drop back against the ribbon where they'll secure themselves with the Super 77 glue. Just like I promised, it truly is the easiest gardenia corsage ever, and it holds so well. Be sure to box it, put it in the flower cooler, keep it cold till the very last minute. Then when it's time, just tie it right around the wrist and it's ready to wear and be beautiful. For more creative inspiration, check out our website at flowerschool.com. If you have questions, you can reach us through there or pick up the telephone at 503-223-8089. Now it's your turn. Find some gardenias, create a corsage, and take a photo. Post it on social media and be sure to hashtag Fall Design Institute so we all can see what you've created as you do something you love.